what it do, what it do with Good Cows RC Adventures with another upgrade update of what's going on here. Okay. Now, I told y'all in the video that I put a new uh, gift case in. And um, I still have the new gift case. But uh, and, uh, this is my uh, old rear gift case that I had. Um, so I decided just to um, use that. But what happened was I had GPM input gear and diff gear. And um, so it shattered and whatnot. So I ended up uh, went on James RC and buying the whole diff assembly, diff case and diff, um, diff case and diff all at one. So I ended up just do a quick swap and that's it. Ended up saving this just a case. And I said I had a brand new case too. So you see here that is complete. I got two shims there. So I do. Um, from the factory is one shim, but I usually have I, I, I have another shim to bring the mesh a little closer to the input gear. I don't know if y'all can see that or not. Input gear. So there's not much play in there. So and this is from a front diff, and um, you can see the diff gear here, just fine. Why not? So. Right now, I'm running sixty K from uh, Team Associate, I mean, um, Team Loshi, sixty K and the front. That's what I've been running. Um, in the rear, I got thirty K, but I'm about to go ahead and um, do. 60 in the rear though, but um, I'll probably do that in the next video. Right now, I don't feel like doing it right now, so um, I'm just uh, going to tidy up. And I'm waiting on an RPM arm to come in. I have an a, a extra RPM arm that I have for the front. So I ordered another one. Post beer today. So I'm kind of waiting on that right now because really I, I'm pretty much done. I put that thing back together and call it a day. So um, that's about it, you know what I'm saying? So wait on that. Um, so I'll do a bunch of candle tutorials and whatnot. But uh, yeah. But if y'all don't have it, armor, this is what it looks like. And I said, it's new to. Uh, Service your diffs, man. You know what I'm saying? So, that do maintenance and whatnot. But, uh, anyway, let me tell you a story, though. When I took the diff out, the screws um, was backed off. You now, my fluid leaked out. So, I didn't have no fluid in the diff. So, what I did is, uh, I'm going to try it out. I put some, um, some tire glue in the thread hose. So, hopefully, that'll hold up. And why not? So I see what it do. So so I see what it do. Anyway, man, that's Big Cow's Arm RC Adventures, man. One more again. And I see you on our next video. Like, subscribe, dislike, whatever. Hot your boy. Raw and uncut. So I do it, baby. Hot your boy.